resort is famed for its picturesque beaches and cliffs overlooking the city. The houses lacked foundations and weren't built to withstand extreme weather. But in March 2018, the UK was hit by some of the most brutal storms on record. It may have been spring in the UK, but a powerful cold storm blew in from Siberia. So bad it was nicknamed the beast from the east, and it lashed the country. In Hemsby, waves hammered the cliffs, which started to collapse, started to collapse. In just two days, the cliffs receded by over 16 feet. The storms of the beast lasted a month. By the end, 36 feet of cliffs had disappeared. Sadly, it went over the edge. And it just went with a big crash and a bang. But the beast wasn't done yet. Lance's home took a further beating. Subsequently, the storm that we had knocked another 20 meters off. So we've basically, we've lost 40 meters off the back of my properties. The storms left 13 clifftop homes uninhabitable. With so many homes falling over the edge, residents are hoping for a solution. As the saying goes, you can't hold back the tide. But with modern engineering, we can try. One of the options that people have considered uh, recently is, is what we call managed realignment. So you can make decisions to essentially let nature take its course, but guide it a little bit. In Hemsby, work has begun on a chain of honeycomb-shaped concrete blocks, a so-called beehive barrier. The chain is designed to allow tidal waters to pass through while absorbing the impact of waves before they reach the cliffs. Concrete barriers are ugly and expensive, but if the alternative is that people go lose their homes every time there's a big storm, then it's probably a price worth paying. No, it's not. No, These it's not worth paying. These defenses 